the bill so you guys are notified when I post another video. I hope you guys enjoy. Hey guys, Andrea. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, thank you for stopping by. Today we are going to do another clothing haul. Uh, we have some Boohoo stuff and also a new brand that I'm trying out called BT BTB Los Angeles. So the Boohoo, I know I've already done a Boohoo clothing haul, but I had to order some more stuff. And Boohoo is like my go-to place I use when I need something quick and fast and this that I know the delivery is going to get here on time. Although Boohoo failed me this time. Like I had paid for express shipping and my stuff didn't come on time. Like I needed it for an event and I paid for the express shipping where it would be here in three days. And Boohoo got it to me way later than what I needed it for. So I had to end up improvising and going with a plan B. But usually Boohoo doesn't fail me. So as per usual, I can't just buy one thing on them. So I ended up buying a couple pieces and I think I got like one bag. Because uh, I'm just trying to build up my little collection of purses. And so, I got a couple pieces. Two of them look the same, but they were like $4. And I was like, why not? Um, cute little flannel top or uh, shirt dresses. And so, I purchased those. And then, I have a wedding coming up. And I wanted to accessorize my black dress with pink. But I realized I didn't have like a cute little, you know, wedding bag to carry that was pink to accessorize my dress. So, I ended up doing some searching. This company called BTB Los Angeles. It's like a boho type chic company. Um, they ended up popping up on my Google search. And I love their bags. Like, when I start working again, they're going to be getting some more of my money out. <laughs> um, yeah, so I love their bags. Um, so I'm going to see what it looks like in person because I haven't had the chance to even open the box so we're gonna do that now and then we'll get into trying on the clothes that i got from boohoo hopefully i can wear it hopefully i tell y'all the accurate sizes in the video and not actually have to put the title because i don't know how to read boohoo's tags but i did notice that the tags are in uk sizes so um i'm gonna pay closer attention to that but i'm pretty sure i ordered a size i don't know i'll let y'all know so first let's start off with the BTB Los Angeles bag. So it came in this box here um, and it's literally just been sitting on my floor. So I'm going to open this. Oh, and I didn't even do it on the thing, y'all. Special, special. They take this little bag and box up good. Special, special. So, let's get that open. I mean, this takes a bit. So, that must blow. So, let's see the receipt. So, this is what it looks like inside the box. And I purchased two pink bags. Oh, this is bigger than what I thought it was going to be. So, this one. This big old box of these two bags. <laughs> So, let's take it out of the bag. So, you have a cute little plastic bag. It says BTB Los Angeles. Um, and this is cute. This is a, the, I'm going to tell y'all what it is. Give me a second. So, it does come with the chain. So, you can carry it like this or you can put the chain on it and it's a gold chain. So I probably, because it's a wedding, I'm probably going to carry it with the chain because I honestly don't like carrying stuff like this. I don't like stuff in my hands, um, especially because I carry my phone in my hands and I just, that's just too much in my hands for me. So this bag is not like the bo uh, Boohoo, but it had the tags on them. So let me tell y'all what bag I got. So this bag is called the Mina Clutch. And it's in the color petal. So, super, super cute. Now, this one is a lot bigger than what I thought it was going to be. And let me go ahead and pull it up on my phone. This is called the Chloe bag. And this is in mauve. But, super cute. It's different. Let me show y'all. Super cute. This is the inside of it. And it gives me like... 
it gives me like vacation vibes like cute like if you're going to an island somewhere cute little um vacation vibes it's wooden so it doesn't have the deets on here on like you know what it's made out of or none of that but i think it's super cute now this one obviously you have to carry it in your hand because there's no chain but i think it's super cute i like it um I'll find something to do with it, but it, I don't think this is wedding for the wedding. This one, I will probably carry to the wedding. Gonna put the chain on it so you guys can see what that looks like. If I can see what to do with it. Let's see, let's see. Where the chain go? Where the chain go? Okay, so I have to take this off. Hold on. I guess you could do it like this. And you can also do it crossbody. So you can style it differently. I personally am going to wear it like this to the wedding. <laughs> so super cute. And it's very simplistic. Like it's not too much. Um, yeah. I love it. So and it'll go with my accessories of pink. Um, I'm going to have to do gold accessories because of the gold chain. So that is that for... The B2B, um, I'm talking about the B2B Lord, BTB Los Angeles bag that I got. So now let's tap into, ooh, let's start this on bed. Y'all know we love so stuff. So, got a couple items. Let's see what we're going to start with for me to try on for y'all. couple blacks. And this is black. So we'll start with the, the purse since we own the purse tip. So this is the um, chunky chain bucket bag in tan. So I just bought it to lose myself. And again, I feel like at this point you can never go too wrong with too many bags. So yeah, well I guess that's the chain. And let sound. So here we go. Obviously, do it on the side. Do it crossbody. And then to make it look more of like a bucket, they have the drawstrings here. So I'm guessing we. I don't know why I thought it was gonna pull in like that, y'all. I told y'all I was special. <laughs> special. And make it look more bucket style. So, super cute. Super cute. And I already know my sister get home. She's going to be trying to take stuff. Back to Tallahassee with her. So, I'm going to have to keep an eye on what I buy. And what go missing. Because she be good for it. I be like, girl, you. I know I'm grown. I'm good and grown. And I act like I don't go nowhere. But, damn, when I do be going somewhere, I would like to have some stuff with me. Like, she don't tell all my little designer. So, yeah. So, this is the flannel. I'm just give y'all the name. What it take? So I ain't got time to be memorizing stuff. So this is the check oversized shirt dress, orange, and this is a size eight in the U.S. So I read the tag for y'all that time. So let's see what it's giving. I don't think I needed to button it down that much, but you know, step into it. That's what it looked like. And obviously you can find something to tie around it to wear to make it more of like a little fitted dress. But it's really just, I would unbutton these and roll these up. Maybe do a sandal with it or some combat boots depending on the weather. And just kind of, you know, style it like that. Um, It does button all the way down. So you can, if you want to make it a little bit more sexier button it don't go all the way down um you probably also do some kind of tight so i back a short with it and tie it up something like that so you can do different things with it that's one thing i do like about baggy stuff and like oversized stuff is the fact that you can you can style it differently like if i want to instead of wearing this as a dress i could you know bring it up and tie it and wear, wear it something like that so 
that's one advantage and benefit of buying like oversized type products so that is this one and so this is the same same exact thing same exact thing just a different color and i don't i will drop the description i mean the links in the description so you know exactly what i purchased um this is also a size eight so i'm gonna try it on just so y'all know what the color look like um but yeah same thing you can style it differently wear a combat boot with it or a sandal or if you want to go out if you're going out for a cute little date night you put a heel with it um like a nice sandal heel or wedge i got some black wedges that i could throw with this but again we're in florida summer coming we ain't wearing this. <laughs> we are not wearing this here. No, ma'am. And like I said, I will unbutton. I don't like button sleeves. Button and fold. Um, that's just me, though. I just don't like that. So, this is this color. I ain't even going to button it up all the way. Um, and you could do like a tank top underneath it. Like, see, I'm just getting ideas. A tank top underneath it or bra. And just wear it open. Like, but now... You know further down to give you more like a v um and you know style it differently do different things with it but that's what this color looks like um moi turn around see i see the back so yeah oversized all right let's see what this white dress is talking about so i go to church on sundays and i'm trying to build up my church collection so i ended up buying this dress because it's white and it's super cute and I need something to wear on first Sunday because on first Sundays we wear white. So this is the Brodery Smock Mini Dress. And it's in color white, obviously. So I'm going to try that on and I'll let y'all know how. I will show you guys, show you guys how it goes. Alright, so BRB! Alright guys, this is what it looks like. And super, it looks super childish, guys. <laughs> but... It'll do for me for the little two, two and a half hours that I am sitting in church. And because it's white, you can literally do any color with it because it's white. So you can do a pop of color, you can do a new color, you can mix your colors. Because to know me is to know I don't care what the colors look like. I feel like I be cute the way it go. That's just me. But um, it's stretchy. This is a size 10 on me. This is the front, back, um... It I it does do, it does have a V and one thing I do like about the V is that it's not showing too much cleavage like I'm going out somewhere so it's still conservative enough to wear to church so I do like that um yeah so like I said I probably could have did a size eight because of the stretchiness in the dress but yeah and then it has like a little a, a mini slip it doesn't go all the way down but yeah that's that and that's you know this look. All right, so let's see what we're going to try on next. I'm going to say the wedding gala type stuff for last. Now, this dress cost me $4, I believe. So, this dress is the 90s neck mini bodycon dress. And I bought it because it was $4. And I could just wear it at home because I'm sitting at home most of the time. Um, even when I'm not doing nothing. So, I figured it'd be something cute to just, you know, throw on. So... This is a size, let me make sure I'm looking at the right thing, a size 6 in the U.S. Because see, I was going to get our U.K. size. So, this is a size 6 in the U.S. So, so it's very simplistic. Very, like, really like a, uh, if you're going to run errands or you're just going to grab something or <laughs> you just want to throw it on because you just could shower and want to be cute in your house, it's one of these type of dresses. So, I'm um, going to try it on and I'll be right back. All right. Here we go. So like I said, very simplistic, all black. I don't have a bra on. Probably wouldn't even wear a bra with this dress because it does um, hold my boobs in. So like, or up, should I say. So yeah, it's, it's stretchy, but it's it's fitted. Like it fits, and you, as you can see, it fits your body like a glove. Like, so definitely, like I said, this could be something you throw on when you go on errands. Just because you want to look cute in your house or feel sexy for your man or 
whatever it may be um this is what it is and like i said it's a size six on me so that goes to show you how big it runs because i'm usually a size eight to ten so this is a six and i still got room like look so yeah that is this dress hope you guys like and if i did wear this outside of the house let me see i could me i love little dresses like this with a sneaker like a cute shoe or um not like a running shoe but like a like a yeezy or like a nike um air force or something like that i'm as any of my friends or anybody that know me <laughs> Like, since I was in high school, like, I would be quick to throw a sneaker on with a dress. Like, and they used to make fun of me, but now you see people doing it more often. So, I am not really that, I, I wear sandals and stuff, but, like, at night. Like, I feel like sandals, like, a cute little sandal is more for, like, a nighttime event. Like, during the day, I'd be quick to throw on, um, a sneaker, because I don't like my feet getting dirty. So, that's just me. That's just me. But that's how I would style this with, you know, obviously some accessories, um, whether it's gold, silver, or pop of color, depending on the shoe. It all depends on what I'm going to do with my shoe. So, that's that. Alright. So, let's see. So, this is a daisy print, rush, frill, hem, mini dress. And some flowers. And I bought it. All this stuff was on sale, but I'm about to start working again very soon. And I just needed something to, like, wear in the office. And this looks very childish now that I see it. It looks so much cuter. <laughs> it looks so much cuter on Boo's website, but what drew my attention to it was the fish frail at the bottom. So I'm gonna try it on, and I'll be <laughs> right back. All right, guys. So here's this look, and I mean, what when you pop that stuff on, say you get what you get. Um, it's cute though. Don't get me wrong. It's cute. It just give me childish vibes with all these sunflowers on it. But <laughs> at the end of the day, it's a. I feel like it's a cute little like office type vibe because the uh, office I'm gonna be working is super. It's not too like business formal. So this is something I could wear on maybe like a Friday or something like that. <sighs> yeah, this is super cute. Um, this is a size ten in the U.S and um it's polyester material with a little bit of like elastane so it's like an elastic um stretch to it so yeah i mean i think it looks cute on me i think it fills out my shape like i said this part right here the um is what drew my attention and my interest into the dress like i love dresses like this for some reason so like i said it's super cute um it got different colors in it, so you can style it with a black heel, a sandal, or a yellow heel or sandal, or gold. Um, like I say, it just depends on the day for me. So, this is what this dress looks like. Alright. Okay. So, this is this look. <laughs> um, but, no, this is um, definitely polyester with a little bit of last name material. Like I said, this is a size 6. No, a lot. Size 8 in the U.S. So, cute little date night dress. And also, wedding type of event. Like, if you got a black tie wedding coming up, um, and you don't want to do too much, like, you want to do just enough, like, it's that type of material, and it gives off that type of look. Um, but, yeah, if you're going on a cute little, like, fancy restaurant type date night with your man, or with your girls, or on vacation and it's your birthday and you want a cute little um simplistic dress for one of the birthday festivities i love the material i love how it fits me um it's a little tight at the bottom so if you walk in in heels you're gonna be probably stepping <laughs> like this is the stretch if y'all can see that so i will say that but I, I love it i love it i love the way it fits like the way it hugs super cute super 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 cute so yeah, that's this dress in a size 8 US on me. I super duper duper, like I really do recommend this dress. Like it's super cute. It's something nice, like something you want to have in your closet just to utilize. Like just to have um, because you can use it on pretty much any occasion. So I like it. Alright, that's that. Alright, let's go to the wedding looks, wedding looks, wedding looks. So I bought two different wedding looks. Don't know which one I'm going to go with yet. So this one is the... Shife and Ruffle Punch Maxi Dress. 
this is the one I'm really leaning towards. Um, so we'll see. So I'm gonna try it on and I'll be right back. Okay, this is this dress. This is the one I'm hoping to wear to the wedding tomorrow, but I can't zip it up because I can't reach. Like, if you look, I can't reach my back. So I'm gonna, and I don't have nobody here to help me assist in that. So <laughs> hopefully it zips up all the way to where I could wear it um, to the wedding that I'm going to. But I love this look. I love the side boob action, the cleavage action. <sighs> Everybody that know me know I can't stand my boobs. Like, I low-key am considered a breast reduction. Like, I just cannot stand them. But then I have everyone like, oh my god, like, your boobs are so nice. Like, are they nice? But <laughs> they just prevent me from doing so much. So, I try to embrace them as much as I can. I do love a cleavage, but sometimes I wish I had, like, a B cup. Um, so, yeah, that was a little, probably a little TMI. But, um, yeah, this is this dress. Like I said, this is a size 10 in the U.S. So, um, it's obviously long sleeve. So, yeah, this is, this is what this looks like. But I love the maxi part of the dress. Um, and if I am, I like, it has like a little opening here, um, for pictures. So, you can, you know, show a little leg if you want to. Like, very little. Um, uh, but if... This is the option I'm going with. Obviously, let's try it. I'm accessorizing it with the pink. So I have some pink Fem LA shoes. So we'll put the pink purse with it and some gold accessories. So hopefully, this is the move for the wedding. But that's TBD. I'll let y'all know. But this is what it looks like. Super cute. Um, honestly, honestly, if I could find another dress like this with a different style pattern up front, but like the, you know, the flowing of it, love it, love it, love it, love it. All right. So this is option number one. Option number two, in case this doesn't work, also has a zipper. I try to stay away from zippers. And like one thing I can't stand is when dresses don't have hooks at the top. So it makes it easier to zip. Like I can't stand it. Like. People that's making clothes, please hook, put hooks on. Like, this one has a hook. So, it makes it easier to, to, to you know, zip. This one doesn't have a hook. So, we'll figure it out. I'll have my cousin help me later. Um, so, this dress is option number two. And it is the Petite Bandage Frill Hem Midi Dress. And it's in a size 10 US. So, I'm going to try this on. And then, I will be right back. Okay. Alright, this is option number two. So, again, we got some cleavage. <laughs> Boobs. Um, it's cute, but I'm not feeling it as much as I'm feeling option number one. And obviously, I'm struggling to zip it up, but this is the bag. It don't zip all the way up to the top, um, but I can't physically bend that way. But it's cute. I just love option number one better. Um, like I said, I'm a sucker for this. Oh, my God, y'all, I'm a sucker for this. But if option number one don't work out, we're going to go with option number two. Um, it shows more leg, obviously. Again, we'll separate it with the same purse um, with the pink heels and gold accessories. So that's how this entire look is going to get styled or the option number one for the wedding. So last and surely not least, we're going to try on the dress that I was going to wear to my event but it didn't come in time and I'm kind of glad it didn't because this would have been a little too dressed down but it's the textured wave rib maxi dress in stone so I can't wait to turn this light off y'all oh Jesus Christ I can't wait to turn it off so this is what it looks like and of course it freaking has a zipper it's the top. oh no it don't a lot it has a slit in the back so like I said this is a size 10, color stone, and it's the textured wave midi dress, maxi dress, rib maxi dress. So, yeah, it's not a midi, definitely a maxi. So, this is what we have. So, I'm going to try it on, and I'll be right back. All right, so, we did it, y'all. We did it, y'all. We did it, babes. But, no, this is some work to get into. So, it's true to size. Like, if you want to get in this dress, get your size. 
Um, cause it took some, you know, all of that women that us women go through. But I love it. I love the dress. I like the slit in the back. Um, like the way it fits. It's see through. I will say that. You probably see my nips. What else? Um, but super cute, super comfy. Um, it has a little stretch, but it's the getting it over your head, and I got a big old head, so pulling it down, all of that stuff. Side shot. Um, yeah, super cute. And I was going to originally style this with the pink, but this also didn't come in time for the event, so we pushed it for the next event. Um, so I'm going to probably switch it up I don't know what I would style this with um, moving forward but obviously it is a neutral color so you can do a pop of color or just a neutral color um, with this so this is and I would do a sandal type shoe I wouldn't do a pump with this dress um, but yeah so that's it one last swirl this is my hair not fail you know so yeah like I said that is the end of the boohoo plus btb los angeles clothing haul like i said if you are new here thank you for stopping by and if you're returning thank you for rocking with your girl i truly do appreciate it do not forget to like comment and subscribe and press that bell notification so you're notified when i post another video it has been a pleasure babes i love you like i said thank you for rocking with me um if you're new please continue to rock with me i post some amazing content my entire lifestyle from everything I do professionally to personally. So I have more to come. Stay tuned. Just be patient with your girl because she's juggling a lot. But I do appreciate it. Again, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, and ring that bell. Love you, babe. Bye. <laughs> don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and ring the bell so you're alerted when I post another video, babes.